the heat beat now. It was 111 degrees recorded today here in Phoenix. And another stat that could make you cringe. More than 940 children have died of heat stroke across America in the past 25 years simply because they were left in or simply became trapped in cars simply too hot. That's according to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration. And Team 12's Trisha Hendricks shows us how fast the preventable tragedy can happen and some simple things that you can do to keep your kids out of harm's way whether or not you plan to head out on a road trip. Or even hit the trails hiking during the summer months. Last year, there were 33 uh, child-related car heat deaths. Phoenix Fire Captain Todd Keller shares the alarming number of hot car deaths that have been recorded in recent years across the country. 2018, 2019, over 53 deaths. That's the most in at least 25 years, according to NoHeatStroke.org. Our goal is obviously zero. It's a really sad, sad thing, and it's 100% preventable. A child's body temperature rises three to five times faster than an adult. When a child is left in a vehicle, that child's temperature can rise quickly. Always check the back seat before you leave your car. Heat stroke begins when the core body temperature reaches about 104 degrees and a child can die when their body temperature reaches 107 degrees. Keller showed how some of the newer model vehicles like this one do have an indicator saying check the rear seat before leaving the vehicle. Another safety tip. Put a purse back there. Put a cell phone. When it comes to hiking. Anybody's vulnerable. So if you do go hiking, be sure to hit the trails in the early morning hours. We have triathletes, we have enduro athletes, extreme athletes that need to be taken off the mountain. Piesto Peak, Camelback Mountain, those are rated double black diamond trails, so they are not easy. When the National Weather Service issues an excessive heat warning, those are the trails that will be shut down for a good portion of the day. And no matter what you're doing during the triple digit days, be sure to stay hydrated before, during, and after your hike. Heat exhaustion, your body's sweating, it's turning red, uh, your pulse is increasing. Heat stroke is that your body will actually stop sweating, your heart rate is going to increase very rapidly rapidly and you're going to go unconscious. By staying vigilant and following these simple safety tips, you can be sure you and your family will stay safe through the hottest days. Wear hat, light color clothing, sunscreen. When you're halfway done with that water bottle, you're halfway done with your hike. Trisha Hendricks, 12 News. Always an important reminder, Trisha, thank you. For more life-saving summer safety information, just head to 12news.com or the free 12 News app.